Welcome to my Legacy Let's Play. We are back again in Isaiah's live. Let's see what he can get himself into today. And if you guys are just now watching the series, I recommend going and watching all the other episodes because it is crazy. Yeah, so in the last episode, Isaiah has cheated on Corey. And he is known himself as a loyal sim and he's cheated. He's a cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. Corey, I don't think she even knows. Yeah, so Corey has no no idea. Let's go put Lucas up here and back in the playmat and see how he handles it from there. And then we can come down and eat. Why, uh, why did you drop him to the ground? Why do you keep putting him down? Put him upstairs in the playmat. You need to go take a shower, stinky. Laugh milestone unlocked. What's so funny? Lucas started laughing for the first time. The cutest of giggles will now will now escape him while playing with toys and interacting with other sims. More playing and socializing will lead him to start babbling. How exciting. Lucas is an advanced little baby. What's Corey doing? Just eating. Okay, well, she can do that. Let's go tell her what happened. Because obviously he's tensed. Let's go swap the baby milestones. Talk about handiness. All right. We are going to confess to the cheating because obviously we can't even propose, right? Because he feels too guilty. So we're going to confess the cheating and see what happens from there. <laughs> New personality trait. Corey was cheated on by someone she cared for in his jealous rage. Well, how will she ever trust again? Embrace it. So now she is very sad. I mean, they're just kissing right away after all that happened. So he feels broken trust from confessing to cheating. Keeping secrets is hard, but seeing the pain in your loved one's eyes is even harder if only Isaiah could regain the trust he's lost. Let's see if we can win her back before she goes off to work. He can propose to her again. Let's attempt to rebuild the trust. Trust rebuilt. In two seconds. It literally says from loyal trait. Finally, mistakes from the past have been forgiven. Isaiah's better not to screw it up again. And they're just, they're fine again? I say, like, you gotta go to work. Corey, you gotta go to work. Go to daycare. Ooh. Okay, hold on. We gotta get the randomizer out. I didn't actually prepare this time. Dirty money. Going over some routine expense reports, Isaiah notices some lines that don't seem to match up. Upon further investigation, he discovers that a lot of money is being funneled into some secretive executive accounts. Isaiah doesn't have much standing at the company yet, but this seems like the kind of thing he should take to the authorities, right? So, first of all, this is Isaiah's first day of work. Like, he has went to work yet. This is his first day. The options are turn it all over. Isaiah will gain fame and reputation, but he'll lose his job. Or lose the papers. Isaiah's life will continue unchanged. His first day on the job, and he's already getting this, so let's let's flip let's flip it. <laughs> and we're turning it all over. <laughs> so now Isaiah, he just doesn't he just doesn't have a job. He has fame and fortune and he's rich, but now he just doesn't have a job. So he dropped out of school for this job to now not have the job anymore. <laughs> Isaiah, 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 come on now. Okay, we gotta find you a new job. Oh wait, look, we just got accepted, or we just got offered another job. Hi Isaiah, with the impression you've made, I think the social media career is perfect fit. You may not have a lot of followers yet, but we'll get you started as a clickbait writer. Rank three, and the likes will start rolling in. What do you say? Well, let's see. All right. Just like that, Isaiah's back up. I don't know how Isaiah manages to do it, but he he does it every single time. Our bills are due. We got $2,152 worth of bills. I couldn't reach your mailbox, so I threw it. Luca, Lucas has returned to daycare. Isaiah earned $60 from his other job. And every... Oh, wait, hold on. He has a new fear. Everything does not seem to be going Isaiah's way at all lately. It has just been bad news after bad news. People keep saying you never know until you try, but never talk about how it feels after trying something now and not wanting working out. Oh my gosh, now somebody's calling us. Okay, hold on. 
Isaiah can't take another disappointment. It's terrifying and too painful to try again. And that's his new fear. Now his student loan is due right now, all. Isaiah has failed to make a one-time payment towards his student loan. Isaiah has a remain balance of 659. The bank has extended his payment window and stresses. Uh, we have the money to pay it, but, you know, the randomizer is the randomizer. So are we going to pay the bill or are we not paying the bill? It looks like we're not paying the bill. Ignore the payments. We'll get to it when we get to it. Fired. Bad news. Isaiah was fired from his job at Dewey, Tatum, and Howe Incorporated. Whistle blown. Isaiah turns over the incriminating papers to the local authorities who come down to, onto the company fast and hard. A number of papers pick the, the story, splashing Isaiah's name across a few headlines. After the dust has settled, the company cleans house, firing everyone involved with the whole scandal, including Isaiah. Lucas came to daycare, entered the social media career. Isaiah is now a clickbait writer at Sam.tv. He starts Tuesday at 9 a.m. Isaiah has good physical fitness. Maybe he should consider an athletic career. All right. Let's do our work from home task. So respond to mail. First of all, I don't even know where is the mailbox. The mailbox is here. Let's pay our bills. Let's get the mail. Oh my gosh, very tense, looming anxiety from feel, fear of failure. <laughs> that anxious feeling looms over Isaiah as he discovers something new about his himself. A fear that wasn't there before, growing inside, ready to overcome Isaiah into paralysis at any moment. In debt for not paying loans. Taking out loans is easy, but paying them back can be much harder. Need the day out from work. Isaiah has only been to one day at work and he got fired and he only barely started his new career and he goes tomorrow. He hasn't even worked. He hasn't even worked yet. Somehow he has needs a day off. <clears throat> okay. Where is Isaiah's laptop? Here. So now we got to respond to mail for work. I don't even know how you check whatever. I don't even know how you web. Respond to mail right here. Boom, we'll do that. We got some cool money. And now he's going to sleep. Okay, Isaiah. And then Corey, why is she at... Oh, I can't even click on her. She's angry, though. Okay, wait. Now Isaiah is getting another job offer. Hi, Isaiah. I'm from a sports club that's taken a recent PR hit due to poor behavior by our well-paid stars. Your wonderful reputation would go a long way towards helping turn things around. We'd love to mold you into an athlete. We could start you as a dance team captain rank four at work and work with you to develop your skills for the big leagues are you in isaiah went from a loser to now getting job offers off the table but it looks like we will be declining this job offer oh my gosh, another phone call neo lami and i are just ha just had a blast together thank you for your advice okay we probably need to feed lucas and whatnot Let's get him some food. And then since he will have to change his diaper. All right, well. Now we should be able to change his diaper. Change diaper. Play peekaboo. Let's play with Lucas. He's like a talkative little baby. All right, Corey's back home. Did she go to class? Oh, Corey knows somebody else now. She knows Laura. And she's an old lady. What I'm going to do with Corey is we're actually going to go up and we're going to go ski and snowboard. About the mountaintops. Okay, so what does she want to do? She wants to go down the bunny slope, use Mount Komorebi info board, and use a vending machine or the computer to purchase a remedy or deterrent. Okay, so first of all, let's find the bunny slope. All right, let's do anti... Let's do this one. That's the cheapest one, blah, blah, blah. Now, I was about to say the info board is here, so let's check conditions on Mount Komorebi. And I still have not found... The bunny slopes. Like, I don't know where the bunny slopes are. All right. I found the bunny slopes. Right. Go, s go snowboarding on the bunny slopes. All right. Current conditions is fair. So she should be good. Corey got a loaner snowboard from the lodge now, but it's a little janky and doesn't feel great. Purchase a new snowboard. Purchase a new snowboard for her and the bits and bobbles vending machine for a more comfortable ride. So now, but we're achieving our goal since she didn't want... Since she had like a feel, fear of failure and whatnot, right? A fear of unfulfilled dreams. All right, Corey, it's nine o'clock now. Like, let's go home. Isaiah and Corey actually have the same, the same exact aspiration. 
Babel milestone unlock. Blah, blah, dag, dag, ga, ga. Is that similar? Not quite, but getting close. In a very basic form, Lucas is starting to communicate his feelings. Socializa- socializing will... Socializing with more sims and even stuffed animals will surely help shape those syllables into full words. You guys just got him on the dang floor? All right, let's come down here and let's come down here and cook something. Lucas is in our carrier, so maybe he'll just sit there. All right, Corey, you can go upstairs and go to sleep. Oh, she's very energized. She's like cracked. All right, just go to sleep. Go to sleep. I said you need to feed the baby. I want to do a little bit of tummy time before bed. Like, don't put him in the crib. Put him on the floor and put him, do tummy time. <laughs> fine, fine. I said, just, if you're going to put him down, just go to sleep. Grab Milestone Unlock. With all his might, Lucas managed to pick up and grab something for the first time. Continue to play with toys to strengthen fine motor development. And we are going to go into work. You know, it's his first official day. Like, let's go in. I don't understand how she has class and work. Like, Corey, you just need to drop out of school. Yes. Like, you have a full-time job that you need to go to right now in two minutes. All right, send to daycare. All right. Isaiah has another thing popping up. Where's the beef? Isaiah is getting followers on social media, but it's been slow going. As he brainstorms ways to up his online presence, an idea suddenly hits him. Everyone loves gossiping about a good celebrity feud, right? What if Isaiah were to, what if Isaiah were to punch up and start a public argument with someone famous? It's morally questionable and entirely self-serving, but it just might work. Will Isaiah attack a celebrity on social media as a shortcut to get ahead? Isaiah will gain fame by triggering the celebrity, but he will lose reputation and make a celebrity enemy. Or should he just continue brainstorming ideas and nothing go unchanged? Let's ask the randomizer. Tells Isaiah for once is not doing something stupid. All right, Isaiah, welcome back home. How about you go take a shower, you know, and then you eat, and then we'll get the baby. Is he okay? See, he just needs to take a nap. He needs some affection too, but we'll go do our things, and then we'll worry about him. Dang, car, you was at work stinking that bad. Go take a shower. Then you can come down here and eat. Come wake up, Lucas. Let's kiss him. Let's give him a bottle. You're not doing anything that I just told you to do. I told you to give him a bottle. Then change his diaper. And somebody needs... Somebody in here needs to vacuum. Let's do some tummy time. Corey, I'm gonna give you Isaiah's vacuum. Why did you take the baby? All right, tummy time together. Let's do the tummy time. Come on. Who's calling us? Payment... Do okay, okay. Let's see what the randomizer says. It's another payment. We ignored it last time. All right, we'll make a payment. We will make a payment after we get done with tummy time. All right, we'll just do fifty dollars. Hopefully, they leave us alone. Roll over to back milestone unlock. What a sight! Lucas just rolled over on his own for the first time. A monumental first step towards being more independent. Running tummy time together between Lucas and his caregiver will train him to eventually roll over the other way. Corey, what are you doing? Comfort Lucas, Corey. You really haven't done anything. Cuddle him. Bounce him. You can't just sit him on the ground when I tell you to practice. No, no, I don't want, I don't want to do that. That was wrong. That was bad. Or practice sitting. See, he's getting better. Go give him a bath. Oh, he's really tired. So after that, go put him to bed. All right, Isaiah, let's go to bed for you. All right, you go put him to bed and then you go to bed. You know, the last, today was a real easy day. And it's winter fest. We didn't do any, we literally didn't do anything for it. Give him a little bottle. Change his diaper because he's going to need to be, you know, diaper changed. Let's put him in a carrier again. What are you doing with what are you doing with him? Changing his diaper. She will have Corey go down and actually make the grand meal. She hasn't done anything for us. And what time is it? 7.30 in the morning. Let's do the breakfast. Alright, let's go try sitting again. Corey, what's wrong? You're cold. Do you have a thermostat in here? 
All right, let's get a thermostat because I don't know if you guys got one. Roll over to tummy milestone unlock. Lucas has gained the ability to roll over onto his tummy. Now he'll be able to start tummy time on his own to progress his own gross motor milestones even further. Who's calling Isaiah now? Oh my gosh, he's student loans. We're just gonna, we're just gonna make the payments. $500. They just got the baby sleeping on the floor. Ain't that something? Oh, he's sleeping on his stomach. All right, we gotta get the presents thing. For Winterfest, the present stack. There's literally nowhere for this to go. And then the, what is it? The box, not the litter box, the um, decoration box. All right, now let's everybody open up some presents. So, okay, so Corey got a spice of life <clears throat> spice rack and Isaiah got a slablet. Why are you calling us? Hey, Isaiah, I have a crush on Takumi Imani. You think it's worth a try? Honestly, I don't care. Do whatever you got to do. That has nothing to do with me. What is this? Festive spirit. We need to meet away on Santa. All right, let's share the Winterfest, Winterfest, you know, spirit. How do you even do that? Is the real question. Friendly, interest, nope. Hobbies, nope. Gossip, nope. Become best friends. All right. I see Lucas up. Lucas is still asleep. Well, Lucas is not up yet. So when he gets up, we'll feed him and everything. I'm just saying, look at all the people Isaiah knows. And look at all the people Corey knows. She knows five people and three of them are dead. <laughs> like he's already enjoying his Christmas gift right here. Playing with the slab lip. While Corey got her spice racks and she doesn't even cook. Corey's jealous sim. Jealous sims gain a boost of confidence when near a significant other, but can also get uncomfortable when they are not around them. She's angry. Okay, well, look. Let's take a little family trip to the mountaintops and let's go snowboarding and everything. We're just going to go for one day. First vacation milestone. Vacation mode on. Lucas is excited for his first vacation with his family. All the time to relax and have fun. What could be better? Just for me to like hire a nanny right here so she could take care of him. All right. Corey, I'm taking you. And what do you got to do, Corey? Achieve level three rock climbing skill. Complete a hiking trail. Actively ski, snow climb, or rock climb for three hours. Enter a Kadama or forest spirit. Okay, well. The rock climbing wall is near, is over here, right? No. It's somewhere over here. So I see the hiking trails, but like, how do you actually complete a hike? Travel to uh, hike, the hiking map. So there's a map that we got to find. Is it this? Okay, yes. So I, find, I found it. So let's hike to the statue. Isaiah, you go put Lucas down here and leave him with the nanny. Isaiah, you got to come over here and do some bunny slopes. Baby. Babble. Set up milestone unlock. Isaiah, or not Isaiah. Lucas learned to sit up. Now he can experience more things in life has to offer. Practice standing to work on those leg muscles. Use the high chair for the first time to explore baby foods or scoot around time to explore. With a view of the world, Lucas can now experience different levels of fun. Wiggle to music and play with a dollhouse or missing blocks to stay entertained. First visitor's milestone. Knock, knock. Who's there? Lucas' first visitor. Lucas can finally meet another sim outside of his household. Yeah, and just like that, he already knows more people than Corey. All right, let's go see what everybody else is doing. All right, did that count? All right. Oh, she's out here hiking and she has to pee. Why don't you pee before you leave the house? Did she already get it? She didn't get it, so she needs to go ahead and finish that hike. You're riding your bike and the snow is crazy. All right. Okay, Isaiah. Actively ski or rock climb for three hours, but it is getting night. Okay, wait, the number six will be very important to you in the next 24 hours. Hang up. It's Corey. Like, it doesn't matter what things happen to Corey. Lucas, on the other hand, what's he doing? Oh, Father Winter's here. Acquired the skiing skill. A lot of things happen on Social Bunny. Isaiah got a load of snowboard. Blah, blah, blah. Where's Isaiah at? So he's over here snowboarding. How fun. All right, let's go back home. All right, let's go back to the lodge. Snowboarding is terrible. Isaiah doesn't seem to have a good time. Yeah, that's fine. 
he discovered that he doesn't like us. We're going to allow him to not like things. I'm going to see if I can get a crib for Lucas because right now he's just sleeping on the floor. And that cannot be good for the baby. He cannot. There is none. So we'll just buy the skateboards and the skis. We'll get some void critters for Lucas when he's older. Maybe we should get a camera too. I mean, we got the money, right? A little toy for Lucas. Let's go back. Bye right, bye, Nanny. He done peed all over the ground, peed on himself. Go clean go clean him up. First word milestone. Susu, dag dag, llama. Nobody can quite agree on which was said first, but make no mistake, Lucas has just started to speak his first words. And he's in the kitchen destroying something. Give him something to eat. Is there a bathtub here? There is a bathtub. Corey, put him down! Put him down. He needs to go to bed. He's going to be angry. Corey, you need to go take a shower because you stink. Isaiah, wake up. Like, it's already 8 o'clock in the morning. You need to come down here, eat something. I mean, we only got the rental for a few more minutes. All right, Corey, come get some pancakes, fatty. Corey, you're just going out to snowboard again without using the bathroom. Do you hear yourself? You won't believe it. I don't care about your guys' relationship. Like, who even is that? Okay, let's see. For his job, he has to use social media, but can he not do it from the phone? It's almost as if someone is controlling his life. Will Isaiah finally fulfill his dreams or will whoever is controlling his life stops his wishes coming true? Isaiah, we are literally doing, we're here in Mount Komorebi doing your stuff. What are you talking about? Four hours till the vacation ends. You guys go get what you guys got to get in. Just leave Lucas here on the floor. Very angry, losing control from unfulfilled dreams. Oh my gosh, Isaiah is getting another job offer. Why is he so famous? You might be wondering why a top you might be wondering why a top secret agency like ourselves would reach out to someone with as big as a reputation as you have. Why? That's the whole point. People regard you so well. Who would expect that you're a secret agent? If you're up for it, we'll pencil you in to start at a lead detective role. Rank five. Oh, and by the way, this conversation never happened. Three, two, one, flip that coin. Tells. Looks like we're declining the job offer. Eating for two. Our Corey is expecting. There is going to be a new addition to this household. Another one. Another baby. Another baby, dude. We just had this baby. The baby is here dying. Blow raspberry milestone unlocked. What a cute array of sounds. Lucas learned how to blow raspberries as adorable development of using his lips to socialize and make noise. All right. Cancel and end vacation. Let's go back home. Guys, now that we're back home and I am going to end off today's video right here. You know, I thought this was a cool video. Nice, easy until the very end right now. Another baby is on the way. Well, I'll catch you guys in the next episode and we'll see what baby Corey has. If it's a girl, if it's a boy, leave some names down in the comments below. This has been Breezy and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.